All the residents of Contagra Street have been receiving commendation for their bravery in apprehending one of the bombers of this day newspaper office in Kaduna. Well, the state governor, Patrick Yakoa, who visited the scene of the incident, said it is a sign of the people's commitment to fight terrorism in the country. An eyewitness also gave an account of what transpired in the attack. We were at the office, at the last floor of the building. So we had a bank. So when we peeped out from the window, we saw smoke. So we thought it was fire outbreak. But we saw people running helter skater. So we now had to abandon everything we are doing upstairs and then run down. In fact, I was the person that ran out last. And I didn't know I was followed immediately by the bomber. So when he overtook me here, I asked him what is the problem. He told me there's a bomb inside that place. So I now increased my pace. I ran out. So while I was running out, I met one of the people that are in this building, a familiar face. I now asked him what is the problem, what happened? He said that man that is running took his car and jammed that particular wall there. And when they came to rescue him, he was now shouting that he has bombed, he has bombed, that he will explode any moment from now. So they have left him there and ran away. That was the whole, how the whole compound was deserted. That was the last that ran away. So I now asked them, they should pursue him and get him. So when they caught him along that road, they now asked him to come back and they removed the vehicle. He, re he refused that he's not going to enter that place again. So with beatings and all the rest of them, they were able to force him. He came back. When he came back, instead of him to go to the vehicle, he ran across, jumped the fence, and entered the other premises, the other camp compound there. So they now pursued him to that place. Within the interval of the time, he rammed his car into the building, and about 15 minutes later, while he was there, the bomb exploded. One of the cylinders where they packed the bomb exploded and killed about three people here, wounded over about 10 people. I was so happy and impressed, you know, with the reaction of the people around, you know, here, clearly re responding to the call by government that security is the business of, you know, all of us. And if collectively we put our heads, you know, together, we support, you know, the security agencies, we will be able to counter a lot of all these things, you know, that are happening.